Now there's a trend that's been sweeping across multimedia the past couple years. Remixed video clips turned into commercials, advertisements, pretty much whatever the consumer could possibly want. You've probably seen the videos, but what you probably don't know is where it all takes place. Take a look. Porterhouse Media, Porterhouse Media, hello, check out, check it, check it out, check, 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 check it out. If you watch television, you've probably seen his stuff. ESPN, TNT, ABC, E! Entertainment. Who are you wearing? Carolina Herrera. Who are you wearing? Basically, if you have cable, you've seen DJ Steve Porter's work. You may not have even realized it. It all started with Slap Chop. The Slap Chop video changed my life. My friend gave me a link on YouTube to the original Slap Chop commercial, and I thought, hey, this would be a great thing to fool around with. And was it ever. One million YouTube hits in a week. More than 12 million all time. Almost overnight. The at the bottom. Porter had himself the a new job. The, the sports stuff really took off. I'm back. Press Hop was the original. Well, Press Hop 2 bring. came at ESPN's yeah, request. Man, like so did Randy like Moss's One something. Clap. Everybody, One Clap! And an NFL Draft remix yeah. and countless yeah. others, oh, yeah. all for ESPN. Yeah. But it's taken off even further from there. Videos for the Dallas Mavericks, New York Knicks, E, even Mighty Fine Burgers, if you know what that is. And they're doing it all from right here in the Pioneer Valley, in a little notched building in Holyoke. Hollywood has all these people from L.A. that they could hire, or from anywhere, obviously, but yeah. they're coming to Holyoke for their, for their Emmy Award video. You know, it's just kind of like, wow, things are happening. So it's, it's been a bit unreal. But here's the question, how do you do it? I guess it's one part music production, one part video editing. A lot of hours involved and a lot of editing and a lot of fine tuning and uh, precision goes into getting everything just right. And it's not just sports or music videos here at Porterhouse Media. They, they, they can take any video, they can take any, any, any clip of video, tap of a shoe, crack of a knuckle, a bass line for a completely different sound, different sounding video. Just in case you didn't believe me. But they're not satisfied. The goal going forward is to get into movie scores as well as several other media related ventures. All from right here in Holyoke. We're always looking for new verticals of how we can keep ascending and, and evolving. So we don't want to be known as a one trick pony or a two trick pony. We want to keep diversifying. So our strong suits are definitely video editing, music production, and, uh, and we're trying to diversify off those two prongs. You know, and what a down-to-earth guy for a guy that works with big-time corporations, ESPN, TNT, I mean, anybody that you could think of, he's yeah. worked with them. As down-to-earth as could be, really nice guy, so uh, it was a cool opportunity to go over there and get a chance to talk with him for a little bit. Yeah, and when they say how intricate it, it is doing those videos, yeah. I mean, I've seen the guys here just take little things and remix them, and yeah. that takes forever, so you, you can only imagine how much work they put into those yeah. videos. he said that his hours, and all of them, not just that there's, there's probably eight or nine of them that work there, yeah. and... They said they, they never get a break. It's and, constant. And you've got a new career. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Thanks, Mike. <laughs>